Hello YouTube and welcome to a new series we're gonna be playing through on Tuesday Thursdays on the channel called The Room. Now this game uh, is created by Fireproof Studios who have graciously given me the permission to play their game and thank you guys so much for letting me play your game. There will be links to the developer's website, the Steam store page, and the game website so please guys please 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 take the time to check the links below, check out these developers, check out what they do and check out their game. I really stress that in every new series I start because it takes a lot to make a game. It takes a village and a half and seriously go give them some love because they allow let's players to play their game and it's amazing. Anyways this game is supposed to be set in an abandoned house where you get an, uh, a suspicious or a mysterious invitation. Um, and it's supposed to be a super hard puzzle game, and it's got tons of awards, tons of positivity around it. Uh, I should mention this game is not free on Steam. It's about five US dollars. I will leave a ton of links in the description, so please check them out, but let's, uh, get into this. Game's about to be- supposed to be about two hours long, and it's creeping me out, so. About two hours long, we'll be doing this, uh, Tuesday, Thursdays. Tutorial, click to begin. Uh, click and drag the mouse to look around. Alright, pretty self-explanatory. Uh, double click on the envelope on top of the safe to focus on it. Oh, there we go. Okay. Slide the letter out of the envelope. You came. I knew your curiosity would get the better of you. Please excuse the mess. My housekeeper abandoned me shortly after the rest of the world. The answers you seek are inside this box, along with something else. Something I said could never be built. It is the only one in existence, and it is the key to incomprehensible power. This safe was constructed to keep it from lesser minds. I have every faith in you solving its mysteries. You always were the smart one. With the enclosed key, I gift you one parting favor. Keep this eyepiece with you always. Without it, you are as blind as the rest. The stakes are higher than you could possibly imagine. A.S. So that's the thing. This game is supposed to be about you trying to get inside this one box. Trying to get in here, solving puzzles everywhere, trying to just get inside to see what's in here. I'm excited. Uh, click the key. A small brass key with an animal motif. Alright. Rotate the lid to line up the keyhole. Oh, okay. Whoa! Neat. Right. Uh, drag the key into the keyhole. Turn the key. Open the lid. Pick up the- Feed me and I shall survive. Give me a drink and I shall die. Curious eyepiece. This is creepy. Alright, click it to wear it. It doesn't do anything. Perhaps something's missing? What does the note say? Feed me and I shall survive. Give me a drink and I shall die. A riddle! The solution must be here somewhere. Right click to zoom out. You find the answer somewhere on the safe. Okay. Feed me a drink. No, feed me. I shall survive. Give me a drink and I shall die. It's over here. What is this? Some of my dusty old books. I don't think they'll help me here. Right? Give me a drink and I shall die. Somewhere on the safe. No, 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 I don't want any hints. Bespoke, bespoke safes for the gentry, Guilford, guaranteed theft, and proof. What is this? A strangely shaped keyhole. Okay. Have it over here. What is this thing? A strangely shaped keyhole. Can't do anything with that. All right. What is this? I can't look at any of these. Okay, alright. Hmm. Feed me and I shall survive. Give me a drink and I shall die. Feed me and I shall survive. Give me a drink and I shall die. Fire, right? It's fire. The answer to the riddle is fire, but... The answer to the riddle is fire. It's gotta be. If you feed fire, it will survive. Give it a drink and it will die. That's just how it is. Might be able to unscrew this if I had something to grip it with. Okay. 
Without a lens, it's just an ordinary eyepiece. Okay. Need a special lens. Hmm. Oh god, right there! Right there, right there, right there! I see it! Fire! Fire! Wood feeds it, but water pushes that. I guess I should give it a push. A peculiar old key. There's something unusual about this key. I should take a closer look. Click on the key in the inventory to examine it. Rotate the end of the key. It looks like I can turn the end of the key to make it into a different shape. Oh, okay. Wait, so are you saying this key fits all these keyholes? It worked? Oh my god! Oh! An ornately engraved metal plate. The end looks like it could be used as a wrench. Okay. Wait, 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 wait. What is that? What is that right there? What is this? Can you get that? No? Well, I saw this earlier and it needs to be wrenched. Oh, baby. Oh! The lens! We found it! A lens that looks like it would fit in the eyepiece. Shit. What? Holy shit. What in the world? Okay, wait, let's get up here, see if we can open this with our key. Can we? I don't I don't know if that's the right shape. Fit. These seem to rotate, but there are no markings to show. Oh, this is creeping me out. Wait, how did I mess that up? Wait. Holy crap! Oh, this game is so cool! Did I just finish it? It's open. Well, well, let's take a closer look. Chapter complete. Pleasing progress, but do you really think you've proven yourself yet? Pleasing progress. Continue game. Oh. I completed the first chapter? Oh, I'm so smart! How many chapters are there, I wonder? These three seals stand between me and the contents of this box. This is so fucking cool. Okay. Locked up tight. Nothing here. Whoa. Cool. What is this? Hmm. Nothing special. Eyeball? A plate with an eye symbol on it. It doesn't seem to move. Hmm. What are these? Oh, it's a combination. Oh. Whoa! What am I seeing right now? What? No hints, I got this. Seven, two, five, four? Seven, two, five, Four? No? I thought I had it. Okay. That is so cool. This game is really, really cool. It's- as, as far as I know, it's not meant to be a horror game, but what it does do is it's testing your mind. And that is so fucking awesome. I can't even begin to describe to you guys how cool this is. My commentary might be a little lackluster, I know, but oh man, I appreciate this greatly. Um, I thought I had it. Looks like a four. 
That looks like a seven now. Five, seven, seven, two? Don't know. I don't know about that one. Hmm. What about the zero up here? No? Hum num. Okay. Seven, five. The only number I see up here is a two so far. Let me spin it around a little bit more. Yeah, seven, five, two. So this one down here must be wrong, but what number would it be? I don't know. I don't even know. Oh man, this is cool. Okay. Let me look around the rest of the box real quick here. What is this? A plate with a cog symbol on it. It doesn't seem to move. A circular indentation seems to connect the mechanism inside. Okay. I wonder how this game saves. I hope this game saves. Uh, your progress will be saved. Okay, cool. Uh, anyways, what was this? Okay. Oh, jeez. Uh. No. Alright, let's look around with our eyepiece. Alright, so far the only thing that stands out is this part. So I gotta figure this out, man. Okay. Hmm. Hmm. Okay, so five and seven seem to be locked in on the left and right side. So, if that's true, then... Two. I feel confident that this one's two. I really do. So that's so clear. But this one down here can be either a four or a seven. It can be a four... Six? Oh, there's six right there. Oh! What is this? What is this? Oh, God, okay. What are these? Is this like a projector? It looks like a projector to me. It smells of burning. Yeah, yeah. Right? Oh. Oh, that's an igniter. Wait, then it What's this? February 11th. My research continues at a snail's pace. With these barbaric instruments, I can barely read anything at all, but there's something there. Between earth and fire, between water, water and air, I cannot see it, but I can see its presence. Like the shadow of the object without substance, yet betraying the shape and form of that which cast it. It is the final element. Null. It brings meaning to the rest, just as all the numbers of the world are meaningless without their zero. The circle are petty fools, blinded by their dark arts and their greed. Alchemy is not the pursuit of callow gold, it is the pursuit of this. Are we looking like, oh, like the Philosopher's Stone? Oh my goodness! So this is alchemy related then. Can I open this? Oh! Ooh. This looks like the winding mechanism, but there should be some sort of key. Okay. Okay. What about this? Can we, can we zoom in on this thing? What is this? What is this right here? Can I open that? No? Hmm. Okay, we need a key. Uh... What is that? What is that right there? Zoom in, please. Looks like an ant. Wait, there are symbols over here, aren't there? Here, right here. This guy? Are there lines, maybe? No. Hmm. Well, that one looks like it goes... Th oh, wait! Oh, right there! No, no hints. I got this. I can do this in my head. Right? I'm smart. So this guy must go... 
This one? Yeah, this one. This one goes here. Right? Wait. That might not be the right one. No, it is. Okay. So they must be around the box. Alright, I'm gonna look. Oh, I'm so into this kind of, like, figuring it out on your own game. I mean, they have the option for hints. I obviously don't want to use them, though. Why is this, like, different? What? It looks like a miniature telescope? What? Oh. Whoa! Okay. Oh, this is so cool. I love this game. Alright. Making me think with my mind. Okay, so it probably goes here. Oh, wait, my bed. Here, let's zoom in. This thing probably goes right here. Okay. So what did that do? Is this a projector? It looks like a projector an awful lot. Hang on, I'm looking for two more symbols. What is this miniature eyepiece thing? Is this magic? Oh, I see that. I see that right there. Okay, remember that? Upper left corner. Where's the... Okay, upper left. It's like a... Like a box kind of thing. This one right here. Okay, so we can just cycle through and find the last one, right? Oh, there you go. Yeah, I'm smart. A heavy cast iron key. That is not like any other key I've seen before. Um... Does it... It doesn't fit that keyhole. Don't even joke. Okay. Hmm, I don't know where this one fits, but wait, let's look at this again. Is there something I can do with this? It smells of burning. Can I get it to light somehow? Hmm. Can I put the key in here? Hmm. Yeah, that key is way too big. Can I put it in one of these? Hmm. How about in here? Wait, what are those? What is this right here? Hmm. Okay. Huh. Where would this key fit anywhere? This thing's huge. What about up here? I haven't really looked at the top. It's a star. That's different. What is this? A star-shaped indentation. Can I put the key in it? No. Can I look at it weird? No. Maybe there's a clue in this note. Barbaric, between the earth, air. Yes, yes. The circle. Callow of gold, pursuit of this. There's no words that really stand out. Oh, wait, this leg's different too. Can I look at this? Let me see this leg. It's different. Down here? A short piece of cotton. It smells of paraffin. Do I put it in here? Like a wick? <gasps> oh! Okay. Oh. Okay. Now what? Wait, wait, wait. What now what? Okay, there's light back there. Okay, now there needs to be What is this? Can I put a key in it? No. Something needs to turn this, but what? This is a key? Hmm. What does this key look like? 
It's got a circle. Uh, like a trapezoid looking thing on top. Would it fit anywhere though? Huh. No hints, I got this. A cog symbol. Hmm. Oh, Jesus. Okay. But we're going to have to end this episode here, guys. Uh, Jesus. This is... Wow. What a game. Okay. <laughs> so, hopefully you guys have basically seen what this game is going to be like, what this playthrough is going to be like. Not sure how many episodes there will be. Probably just a few. Probably two or three. But this game looks really fun. I wanted to play through it for you guys. So... If you guys like this game and you want to solve it on your own, then please check out the links I put down below in the description. Again, it's really, really cheap. $5 on Steam is not much. Five US dollars, I should say, on Steam is not too bad. So please check it out if you wish to experience this for yourself because I am having one hell of a time doing this. I'm having a blast just playing through, trying to do these puzzle things. So check it out yourself if you want to. And uh, yeah, thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you enjoy this episode. Please check out the links in the description down below that I will put. And uh, yeah, uh, if you liked the video, please leave me a like or a comment down below. Please no spoilers. I want to try and figure this out on my own without hints as best as I can. And yeah, so thank you guys so much for watching. If you enjoyed the video, then please leave me a like or comment down below. And subscribe today for some more in the future. Have a fantastic day and night wherever you guys are and stay safe out there. I will see you in the next video. Bye. So that a bunch of villains ruin my home while I'm away? Find the Herald's banner. That is kind of a scumbaggy thing to do, honestly, to somebody who's not even home.